Damn. Oh shit, that hurt. Hold on. I got you. Damn, Daniel. Back at it again with the white fans. That's the mat. Is that how he said it? I've had a dream. Is that how Martin Luther King sound? Hold on. No, I honestly think that's that's not how he sound. No. Maybe his voice was more monotone. Like, I seriously want to get it right before I even start this video. So, hold on. God damn it, YouTube buffer! Speech! 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 I just want to hear him say the speech. Oh my gosh. You know what? Never mind. Sorry for wasting your time. There's no speech. I have a dream, literally, that one day I was going to be 85 and I was going to be sitting on my front porch drinking sweet tea with a hint of peach. I remember it because I put peach in it in the dream. And then I woke up this morning coming to the conclusion that I want to die before I turn 35. Literally, for the past couple days, I was just thinking to myself, like, I'm about to be a senior in high school. What the fuck now? I don't even know what I'm going to do now. Like, after high school is over, I know I'm gonna lose all the people that I was talking to. I know I won't talk to anybody, barely, because I haven't even done anything this summer. I woke up 30 minutes ago, and it's currently 2.35 in the afternoon. Because I feel like once you turn 35, I feel like you've probably done everything that you can. Now, me and you probably have a different perspective on 35-year-olds. When you see 35 year olds, you probably see like the young, good looking Leonardo DiCaprio. When I see 35, I think of Bob Duncan for some reason. Like he just plays, like he's just there as soon as I think of 35. And I don't want to be Bob Duncan. I want to be Leonardo. But the thing is, nobody can be Leonardo DiCaprio. Come on. But the thing is, I'm realizing that I'm growing up way too fast. I'm about to be 18. Um, I'm about to graduate high school. I really don't have anything much to live for, so why not die young, right? Right? No? Yeah, this sounds a lot more horrible now that I'm filming this video. But the thing is, is that when I had this dream, like I said, I was sitting on the porch, right? I called my dog over and my dog started talking to me. I don't even have a fucking dog. I don't know, I guess it was, I, I got a dog. So my dog walked over to me and my dog handed me a suitcase. Right? And then all of a sudden, when I got the suitcase, all of a sudden, the light before my eyes just shined. I don't know if that's like God calling me home. God, if you're listening, please call me home sooner. Okay, let me knock on wood. Like, I'm not saying I just want to die. Like, I have multiple things I want to live for, but like, just think about getting older. Like, literally within maybe a year, if not less, I'm going to be having to buy my own laundry detergent. Like, who the fuck? Like, I don't... Who's gonna sit in Walmart and looking at either Tide Pods, which look edible, or Tide Soap? Like, I don't understand. People wanna move out so badly, but I'm just like, what the f- why? You gotta buy your own food, you gotta buy your own laundry detergent, you gotta buy a vacuum cleaner, you gotta be able to clean the whole entire house. I don't know about y'all, but this room is dirty as fuck, okay? I know I sound super lazy, but y'all, some, some of these things that I'm saying are just jokes just to add to the effect of proving my point. But this room is dirty, okay? I don't wanna be able to clean two more rooms, a living room, a kitchen, two dishes, and all that by myself, you feel me? Like, I'm not a mama's boy, let me just say that. But mom's cooking is pretty bomb, okay? You gotta learn how to cook by yourself, you gotta buy stuff to cook stuff, you gotta buy stuff to cook stuff with, like pans and shit, you gotta buy soap, everything, like, Oh my God, like literally, I'm gonna make a vlog for when I first move out either into college or into my own place and I'm going to vlog me going to the store to buy a bunch of stuff. But watch how many Walmart trips I will take. I guarantee I'm gonna take at least three Walmart trips early in the day, early at night. I'm gonna be like, oh shit, I forgot to buy air freshener. Oh crap, I forgot to buy a TV. Oh snap, I forgot to go get corn. Oh crap. I realized to make eggs, I need to get a pan. People want to move out so bad. Y'all don't realize what's about to come to y'all. I'm so sorry, y'all. We got bills. We got everything in life. And I'm complaining way too much right now. But it's just like, why? 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 I think this dream was a real eye-opener for me. I have come to the conclusion that I won't die 35. Because 35 isn't even that old. It's like middle age, but it's old, okay? 
I give it to about 40. 40 years old. I'm sorry, mom. It's getting up there. It's really getting up there. Well, guys, thank you so much for listening to me complain about life. I'm sorry. I felt like I just had to get this point across, and I know today's an upload day, and I didn't even upload for the past week. So, if you guys really like this video, and you guys want to motivate me to actually make videos, I recommend you subscribe right now. Make sure you leave a like, comment, and all that other good jazz. Oh, snap. Are you riding? So you never ever leave from beside me, because I want you. And I need you. And I'm down for your whole Boy, I've been bumping that shit all day. I should do the challenge. Have y'all been seeing the challenge? If y'all want me to post a challenge, make sure you like and subscribe. We're almost at 1,300 subscribers. Come on. If you're watching, just, just give me that. Just give me that. Motivate me to continue uploading. Because... Kiki. I am What's Good Xavier, and you just watched the video. Goodbye!